Hey guys, so today I'm doing my updated foundation routine. So let me just get started. I already applied my moisturizer, which is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Cream Intense Hydration. This is a great moisturizer, especially for the colder months. This is really awesome, or if you have really dry skin, it's great as well. So I already applied that, and for my foundation today, I'm using the Wet n Wild Bare Focus Tinted Hydrator, and I use the shade Porcelain, and it just looks like this. It's only like $4.99, and it's a really awesome skin tint foundation, whatever you want to call it. I adore this, so I just use my e.l.f. sponge, and we're going to apply that to the skin. So, just... I have my mirror here so if you're wondering why I'm looking at that is what I'm looking at the mirror so I just kind of tap it into the skin all over it is really beautiful it's not like a matte finish it's more of like you know skin natural finish I guess very beautiful And it doesn't look cakey at all. It's just one of my favorites. During the summer months, they didn't have a dark enough shade for me. That's the only problem. I couldn't use this in the summer. Because I think the darkest shade was like light medium. Something like that. And I definitely think they need to expand their shade range. But other than that, it is so so beautiful so I'm just applying a little bit more now this I would say it it's like a medium coverage wise you can build it up a little bit though but I would say this is medium so I just apply this all over I definitely wanted to get a updated foundation routine on my channel. So that is what I'm doing. And I'm recording this on my iPhone 11. I wish the iPhone 11 had a zoom feature. Like you can't really zoom in that well. Or I would do like makeup tutorials with my iPhone 11 because it's much easier because with my normal HD camcorder, I have to, you know, get all the files onto my computer and then edit it and then it has to render. Sometimes I'll edit the videos I make on my iPhone with iMovie, but it's really, really easy to do. So, make sure everything is blended. All right. Now, I'm going to move on to concealer, and the concealer that I use, if I can find it here, I'm missing my stuff. No, I got it. Is that it? Okay, this is it. The L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealer, and this is in the shade Fawn, and it's one of my absolute favorite concealers, so it looks like that. It has this big old doe foot, so I'm going to apply this underneath my eye area, like so, and blend it. I also like to use concealer to like shape my eyeshadow a little bit, especially like the outer edge of my makeup look. I always do my eyes first before any face products so I've been doing that for like I don't know two years maybe two or three years something along those lines then do the other eye like so 
All right, that is the concealer. I just want to make sure it's nice and blended. And if I have any like blemishes I want to cover up and just apply a little bit of this since bronzer will be going over it so it's not going to be just light every in one area but this is a really nice full coverage all right so for my under eye area my face i use the cody airspun loose face powder i love this stuff it smells like a grandma but it does not linger on the skin, which is great because it does have that like, I don't know, mature old people smell. Not sure why they decided to do that for it, but I guess it's been out a while since 1935. So I guess they never changed the, the scent of it. And this will just set everything in and make everything stay put all day. So after I do like the underneath of my eye area, I get, get it all over my face then. Like that. I love this stuff just makes everything look flawless and it's beautiful now let me get a little bit more make sure I get everything so it stays nice all day long okay now we're going to move on to bronzer blush and highlight so for that let me see where I put my favorite one that has I drop a bunch of brushes. <laughs> this is the It Cosmetics Live Love Laugh Vitality Face Disc. I've had this for such a long time, but it's really nice. I love all the shades in there. It's perfect. So I'm just going to apply some bronzer. I don't like to do, go too heavy on the bronzer, but this is just a really pretty bronzer. And it's completely matte. And I always like to apply bronzer to my nose area, my chin. And then, oh, obviously, my cheeks. And then I like to apply a little bit to my forehead. All right, then I'm going to blend, blend it. All right, now for blush, I'm gonna get a, I'm not gonna use what is in the face disc, just because I'm looking for something else. So I'm gonna use a Milani baked blush in the shade Dulce Pink, which is one of my favorites. Such a pretty blush. It's a nice like light pink with some shimmer to it. And it's just stunning. I love this one. All right, just blend it a little bit. Doesn't need a lot of blending, but it's really pretty. So for my highlight today, I'm gonna be using the ColourPop 
super sharp cheek pearlized in lunch money this is such a beautiful highlight so what i do is apply some on my fingers and just tap it onto the cheeks and it's just so pretty i love these like look how pretty that is i love a strong highlight where you can see you have highlight on i love to look nice and glowy i like to apply a little bit on my nose as well and yeah i'm obsessed okay i'm gonna finish up the rest of my eye makeup and then i will show you the completed face makeup look all right i finished the rest of my eye makeup and everything else so for my eye makeup today i used the color pop it's a mood eyeshadow palette and i used a bunch of like the purpley shades in here and that is what i have on in my eyes today and for my lips today i have on the lime crime liquid lipstick in the shade marshmallow which is one of my favorite shades so yeah that is how my face makeup turned out and usually at the end i like to apply the the Catrice Prime and Fine Dewy Glow Setting Spray, which is really nice. It just gives you a nice set and gives you a little bit of glow and it is absolutely perfect. So that is my updated face makeup routine make sure you guys follow me on my instagrams i have my main instagram and then i have an instagram for game stuff like animal crossing and the sims 4 and then make sure you guys follow me on twitter so yes go follow those accounts below and i will see you guys in my next video and i hope you guys are doing well i love you guys stay safe Bye, everyone.